the big fat woman. I think that's actually a song in it. It goes something like, uh, 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 the big fat woman. But I don't know what words. Does anybody know, does anybody know what that song's called? Something, something, you big fat woman. Mm, mm. Where is everyone? Come on! Come on down! Because ah, the price is right! She's here! Hello! Have you missed me? Hi everyone! Emma Ball, the first contender! Hi Emma! How are you doing? How is my bestie right now? Hi Sarah Griffiths! Hi, Nicola Sunshine. What a beautiful name. Right, my face is in comments. Got to sort that shit right out. Two seconds. There we go. Can't have a space in the fucking comments. It's not more annoying. Yay, 256 of you in less than a minute is awesome. Keep it going. Spread your legs, bitches. I'm back. Hi, everyone. Hi, Jade Gardner. Hi, Georgie Butterfield. Hey, 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 everyone. Hi, Louise Skeldon, top fan. Boop, boop, boop. Mary Thompson, hi Donna Watts, top fan. Don't know what this is for top fan now. It must be just summer. It's just coming to my mind. <laughs> hey Gemma Sites, Kayla Ball, Kayla Ball. Hi Kaz Roland, Mandy Wary Adair. Bloody hell, that's, that's a long one, isn't it? Mandy Wary Adair. Let me know if I got that right. Hey Ash Shepherd, hi Samantha Marsh. Hey, hey, hey Samantha Marsh. <gasps> Guess what, guys? So. The dog baits and the pet range is well on its way now. We're literally so close to releasing it. I have seen a sneak preview of the fabric for fabric. Sound like I said fabric. <laughs> fabric. <laughs> Don't know how many people with a fabric do you? Fucking all got a dick pic overnight. I put it on my wall. I were, I were having a glass of wine and all of a sudden Leon messages me. Hey baby, and then a penis. It's disgusting, it is. It's an absolute fucking travesty. Sort it out, guys. We don't like it. Look at this. This is sexy. This is a cucumber. Send me a fucking picture of this any day over your penis because this looks way more beautiful. I mean, how perfect is that cucumber? It's absolutely amazing. You can practice putting a condom on a cucumber, you know, if you struggle and you don't, it, it, you know, you get it wrong. <laughs> Not that you're going to get it fucking wrong. You can practice all sorts of shoes on this. You've got to take this, take this wrapper off first. We're going to do kitchen items tonight, guys, because you know I love, I love a little kitchen item here and there. And I've run out of stuff to review because I've reviewed the whole fucking world. It's getting rather boring now. And I want to change my name from Real Reviewer to Real Show. Ellie Norcliffe, The Real Show, or The Real Ellie Norcliffe Show, but Facebook won't let me change it. So they blocked me on the account. Can't go live on there. And they won't let me change my name on here. So we're going to have to keep reviewing shit because I'm still a real reviewer. But I want a bit real Ellie Norcliffe. But yeah, I'll just get this cucumber out because I'm actually quite um, entranced by it. <laughs> I mean, you'd be a bit disturbed, wouldn't you? I thought this was a lovely shape that way. Definitely that way. Don't, don't, not that way, guys. That way. But yeah, you can do all sorts with a cucumber, all sorts of um, delightful impro, improv and learning things. So yeah, you know, see, learn that deep throat shit because if you learn it, your man will never leave you. You've got to get it where it's a little bit harder with a hard cucumber. It works a lot better with the real thing. But I'm not going to show you, but I can literally do it so it goes down. You know what I'm saying? They don't leave you. They won't go anywhere. Just get that locked down. Trust me. But you've got to do it though. Yeah, I do it like once a year. Maybe that's not enough. But what am I on about? I get a cucumber and my head fucking goes. My cooker has just beeped. Which means my chicken's fucking ready. Because I've cooked a chicken for you to eat. So shall we do that first? I think we'll do the chicken first. This is the most random, random of shit. Spread your legs, bitches. Get me out there because everyone needs to see this. So... I came across these, in great. No, where were I? Dunnell Milnes. Dunnell Milnes have got a right range of like quirky kitchen shit. If you want to do videos, you know, and review weird stuff. They've got a right array of stuff. But I saw these for £3 and I just thought they were funny. <laughs> I don't know why I find this amusing. Do you think it's funny? Meat claws. <laughs> 
meat claws so you get your meat and you can claw it now i think that that's real great i mean when you get crispy duck from chinese which i'm not allowed anymore but when you get crispy duck from chinese it's really hard to do it with a pair of forks isn't it i mean i should have ordered a crispy duck in and would have done it with a duck but apparently these fuckers you know when i get my chicken out of the oven i normally stick a spoon up its ass and then i have to balance it like an egg and spoon race over to a plate so I found these bastards and you can pick it up, look, all elegantly. So we're going to get the chicken out. I'm going to move you so you can see where I'm going and stuff and, and, and come and watch me get out this chicken and see if we can actually pick up the chicken and then shred the bastard for Conrad's chicken sarnie tonight after snooker. Who's with me? So I don't need... Oh, why is it wired up? Don't you just hate it when people put wires on packaging? It's like, that's going to hurt me now. Pissing Nora, get up to date with times, man. Get up to date. Oh, we got hi, Gilly Marriott. Hi, Stephanie, Lauren Bradley. The middle name is pronounced Warry, like Eric Warry. Ellie, thanks for my very first shout out. No problem. Currently hiding in the toilet at work. Best place to be when I'm on Melissa. Keep spreading your legs, pictures. These kitchen items, it's important shit. If you want to you wanna get a chicken out, the right way, well, I'm here. I'm here to show you how to use these meat claws right now. I'm excited to put these fuckers on my hands. Oh, I need to do a little dance. I've got a dance special. Perfect pulled pork or chicken. Pulling, shredding and lifting meat claws. Sounds a bit rude, but it would with me, wouldn't it? I've got this pizza plate. We can put chicken on here and then we can give it a right good fucking ragging. Can't wait. So let's get it out there. Oh, you can toss your salad. You can be a tosser with these claws. Shit, my life. Wash before you, so can't be arsed. It's only Conrad eating chicken. He won't mind, will it? Is he? Fucking red. Right, let's bring you. What, what shall I do? How shall we do this? I'm going to bring you over to oven side. Oh, and then you're going to see all mess at this side, but it's only my shit that I'm reviewing, guys. I've got to unplug my charger. Fuck it. Just take it off. Take the whole thing, Ellen. You're balanced. Oh, I can't pick it up. <laughs> Let's just take you over here a second. Right. This is what we're doing now. This is the first item. Is meat claws. Ignore any mess because I don't clean you up. Just put these. Look at me. Fucking look at me. I'm going to take these out in my handbag. Because surely I can't get in trouble going out in the club. Because if I ever get battered again, I'll just get my fucking meat claws out. No one's going to mess with me. And they can't arrest me for having my meat claws. I'll say it's for my kebab later. I like to shred it up a little bit. It's for my duck to eat. Anyway, let's get chicken out. I'm so excited to lift it out. It's going to drip all over the floor. So this is my plate. You might want to turn comments off if you want to see me have a good old shred of the motherfucker. I haven't even got my headband on. What is life like? I'm opening cooker. Shit. Fucking hot. <laughs> oh, dear. Right. I'll get the actual tray out. Put your, put your claws down. Oh, look at this beast. Sorry, vegans, but wow. This is this has made a great chicken. Right, put that down. Right, are you ready for this now? Turn that off. I'm fucking sweating. Right. Get your claws. I'm dirty, see. I'm dirty, see. Down where it's... I think it's that way. Down where it's wet, I take it from me. Up on the shore, the work all day. In the sun, they slave away. Oh, I wear they boat in. I full time in floating. <sighs> I'm dirty, see. And if you get a bit short... Sorry, Conrad, I'm just going to pick up your chicken. My hair's clean. Washed it today. Right, I've just wiped them again on my pajama, on my pound, pound one pants. Love them. Get them at Poundland. Well cheap. Right, I'm going to do this now. Where, how do I put it in? Where's that picture? Which way does the bird go? Oh, like that. So it's little legs are there. Right, I'm going to tackle it now, guys. Thousand people watching me. We fucking meet claws. What is life? Right. Stick it in. Oh. Oh my god! And you can literally pick it up. This is this is amazing. And then glide it over to your plate. Look at this. 
Oh, it's got its wings back. Bless its heart. But look how you can pick it up. These are three pounds from Dunhill Milnes, guys. And then you pop the bastard down on your tray. You don't spill it. It doesn't drop off. Normally, I put a wooden spoon up its ass and I balance it. And it falls all over and juice goes everywhere. That were amazing. Shall we shred it? Right. You might want to turn comments off just to see me. See it in action now. I'm excited. Poor bastard. Oh, well. It's already dead now. I mean, I haven't got much room here to give it a right good clawing. I, might, I think I'm going to take you back to the other side. Oh, no. Just hang on. Right, so... Oh! Oh! Oh, you can claw at this. You don't burn your fingers. Oh, look at this. I normally use a carving knife. You can't really claw the wings. They're too small. But I've literally just clawed all that chicken. And now I'm shredding it. Shredding it. Like, making shredded, shredded meat for Conrad's sandwiches. Oh, my God. I'm all sweating. <laughs> it's a bit fucking steamy in here. <laughs> it's a bit steamy. This is amazing. <gasps> look how shredded it is. Look. Proper, nice, fresh, shredded chicken. Look at that. Oh, I'm going to have to have a little bit. Hmm. I can eat this on my diet and all. Shred other side off. You just pull it off. It's like magic. Yeah, love these. Five out of five. I wish I had a duck and all because it's quite therapeutic. It's, like, it's very, very therapeutic taking its meat off its bones. Very cruel. Right, so we're going to leave the meat, meat devices over here because we've done with the meat bastards now. We've got a few more stuff and I can't see a thing. So they're all shredded. It's lovely. It works amazing. Five out of five for the meat fuckers. Right, let me get you over here again now. Out of this hot, hot weather. <sighs> Shit, my life. Let me plug you back in. I don't do my charger for that. I'm sweating, guys. I'm tired. Right. Next. What we got next? Let me read some comments. Can someone imagine you in police station <laughs> with meat claws? I know, tell me about it. Oh my God, what have I missed? You've missed, look, you've missed like the meat claws. The best thing ever, please. Three pound from Dunnell Mills. You can pick up your meat, get it out, put it on your plate and then shred the fucker. If anyone ever gets you stressed out, buy a duck. Just do it and... Oh shit, that had a bit of chicken still on it. And get shredding. It's very therapeutic. I enjoyed it. So that is review number one, the meat claw. Five out of five from me. Right, we're going to put my headband on for the next one. Just getting serious. It's getting serious now, bitches. Oh, let's do this. Right. God, I look fucked. Never mind. Hey, 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 Samantha Durnford. I need to get some now, exactly. Get on Amazon and search for meat claws. I think everybody, I think the 200 people that has left has come to buy some meat claws because they're so amazing. Why is this bow dead? What's wrong with it? It's deader than that fucking chicken. Your hair looks gorgeous, Ellie. Thank you, Zoe. Well, we've put this on now because I'm sweating. I'm sweating my tits off. Right, so the next product is this. Now, I've had one of these before. But when I was live, I got it in a set and I didn't really know what it was. And it's a silicon garlic peeler. Now, I don't know how this can peel a garlic. But I've got a, pe a garlic peeler and a garlic chopper because I'm sick to death of working with garlic. And I've been smelly fingers for a week afterwards, even if I disinfect them. Just have to get in here. I've got this garlic zoom. Garlic zoom? Oh, my God. It's because I hate chopping garlic, me. I have the weirdest reviews ever. I'm so fucking random. It's unbelievable. I've shared for you. Thank you. Get spreading your legs, Anne. That's what you've got to do these days. Mother-in-law has just still can't work it out. Mother-in-law. Oh, no, don't say that. If your mother-in-law can't do it, Ellen Orcliffe's got no chance. I'm thick as fuck. I can't do nothing. Especially. Don't stab yourself. I can't do no, especially if it's technical. The garlic zoomer is so good. Emma, I'm going to piss. I get so excited about kitchenware. So excited. We'll come back to you in a moment. We've got lots planned for you, my friend. Back down, Ellie. Sort your red out. Oh, my God, I'm going to need one of those. I absolutely hate chopping garlic. Exactly. Like, these lives, yeah, they're a bit of fun. 
they're a bit of laughs and shits and giggles, but they're actually very useful. Fuck knows how you use this, but there is instructions. I think you put it in and go, and it'll peel. It says, simply. <laughs> Whenever it says simply, it's never as fucking simple, is it? Simply place the garlic into the tube, just using hand pressure or roll it on a worktop until you hear a crinkle sound. The garlic clove comes out very easily without its skin, allowing to have fresh peel garlic in seconds. Well, I'm excited. My tits are fucking hard. We've got this and this. So we can peel and chop without hopefully getting a stinky finger. Because that shouldn't happen when you're cooking. Right, where's the garlic? I bought some garlic. I've bought all this stuff here. I've got like loads of... Here it is. Oh, fuck, I've lost that now. I can't wait to use all this. I've got loads here. Right. Garlic. Come to me. Remind me of her. Who do I remind you of, Roseanne? Ferrero. Love your last name. It always makes me hungry, though. Everyone everyone loves a garlic fanny face. <laughs> I thought you were going to put everyone loves a garlic fanny. I thought, well, I ain't going to fucking rub it in my fanny. Although, it might be good for it. Because things that sound disturbing usually are good for stuff. You know, and it'll give Conrad a laugh, won't it? We'll get it all rubbed in there and go, tonight's the night, Conrad. <laughs> get some from Snooker. Stick him down there for half an hour. Anyway, enough of garlic fannies. God, what do we talk about on these videos? Hi, Katie Charlie Hayes. Thank you. Hey, 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 Hayley Scott. Not being able to laugh all day till I watch you. Oh, yes, Katie, I'm glad that you can laugh. Right, I'm just going to move the potatoes onto the floor. Got stuff for potatoes here and bananas and everything because now we're focusing on garlic. We can only focus on one thing at once and I'm going to put you down here. Now, can you see this on here? You might have to remove your comments to see it. So I'm putting this in here. In it goes. The little lonely garlic. Lonely, I miss the lonely. Then lower it, put it on your cupboard. And it just says, roll like a motherfucker. I can hear it. <gasps> can you hear it? He's still fully fucking dressed. Put it back in. Bit harder. Bit harder, really. Oh, it's nearly worked. Oh, it's on my fingers, you fucker. Oh, it's out there. That wasn't bad. Let's just try another right quick because I think what I need to do is press a little bit harder. I was a little bit tame with the garlic. I was a little bit scared for it. I didn't want to bully the garlic. Benan can't cope. I'm sorry, Benan. Right, I'm going to put it more in the middle this time. Press down harder and we're going to give it a right good raggy roll. In it goes. Come on, you bastard. Can you hear it? Keeps falling out. Two hands, Ellie. Come on, get that garlic peel. Nearly. It, it's all right. It's hard work. It's kind of easier to peel your own. Oh no. Yeah. It don't. It. Mm. Oh, my hands stink now. I think, for the sake of it, I think you can peel your own. I'm gonna give it a three out of five because it does do it. Fucking hell. <sighs> Strong in it, garlic. Would you dare me to eat a full bulb? <laughs> I'm not gonna. But I'd love Conrad to. I like him, so I'll torture his stuff. If I ate a full bulb, I'd probably be sick. You're definitely so much like Gemma out of Coronation Street. Hyper and random. Who's Gemma? She one that goes out with Chesney. Right? Anyway, we're gonna chop it now. That stinks. It's all, it's all sticky. Where's my instructions for this? Oh, it's got a lot. It, it's on wheels. Meals on wheels. What the fuck do you do with it? Well, it's got a little. Oh, it's. Oh, oh. Shit, in Nora, do you put it. Where do you put it? Do you put it in there? I think I need instructions. Where is it? Right, I've got instructions here, guys. Bear with me. Insert one to two. Oh, we can do two at once. In, roll to chop quickly and easily. I'm really excited. You put it in. 
Do you put it in there? Just exciting. And then you close it down. Oh, the garlics are in the building. And then we roll. Look at this. You're gonna die. You're literally gonna die. Oh my god. Oh, how'd you get it out? Because yeah, it's chopped it all amazingly. I think I was supposed to put the garlic in there and then it falls in there. I put it in there. Oh, it's actually really nice. Oh, a bit of that on my chicken. Yeah, but look how finely it chops it. But how'd you get it out? Because you put it with your finger and then you've got a smelly finger. So you've still got your smelly finger. Oh, I've got garlic on me. <gasps> you still got a smelly finger, haven't you? But I do like it. I think it'd be better if it... Oh, it does go in it. Oh, it goes into a separate compartment. And then you open that. Oh my God, all my prayers have just been answered. Five out of five for the garlic chopper. This is by a company called Chefen. Chefen, like Gooden. Chefen. And it was from Dunnell Mills, and I think it was £9 for the motherfucker, but it's good, guys. It saves you all that chopping and stinky fingerage. Um, and what else were I going to tell you about this? It's called Sheffern, and it's from Dunnell Mills, yeah? And it's called the Garlic Zoom. Garlic Zoom. Get yourself one. Absolutely love it. Love it. Right, I'm going back up here now for the next item. I've got back ache. Right, the next one. This. This is a fucking masterpiece, let me tell you. I'm liking the look of this before I've even tried it. Because no one wants to chop a banana. Like, you need help. I'm so lazy, I don't want to go... <laughs> Takes fucking ages. So I've got this banana chopper. And it's called Handy Kitchen Thingy. The banana slicer with two cutters. So you need to get... Oh, no. It's got my worst nightmare. It's got them motherfuckers holding it in. I hate them. Oh. Why is it? Oh, oh no. My knife's done it. My knife's done it. But it's a hazard. It's a hazard for someone like me to get into something like this. Oh, I've got it. Oh, I love it. Look at it. It's awesome. Right? So you put your banana. Oh, my God. Who comes up with this? You put your bottom banana on a plate like so you get your banana you peel it Never. oh god this banana feels a bit soft you peel it oh we can eat this i'm allowed it on my diet you place your banana it's very curved um my banana is very straight it's a very straight banana <laughs> standing to attention that motherfucker and it's had no um no um, sexual arousal. Guess what? I'm so excited. Game of Thrones! Is it on yet? I know it would today, but does it come on at something like midnight, some stupid, or is it on? Can someone tell me? Top, get, top got fans, can you tell me if it's on? Don't give me any giveaways. I'm watching it when Conrad gets home from snooker. I'm literally wet. I'm literally wet with, um, with my juices flowing for it. Right, and then you put this on here. Well, I can't line it up. And then you just squash it together, I think. Oh, really? You've not done a right good job with this. Put it down. So I'm trying to show you, you see. It's on the plate and then we crush it. Right. This is a lot more disappointing than uh, I thought. Because now what? And that's very big chunks, isn't it? I'll choke on that, me. I want little fine chunks. That's the whole point. Like, that's not going to take me long to cut that size chunk, is it? If it was smaller chunk, it's going to take me... Or maybe I put it further to the middle. And then... Oh, no, it's got chunks cut inside. Oh, I see. Scrush it down, Ellie. This is stupid. How'd you get it out? Well, that's shit, because look, I've just got little vaginas. Why have I got little vaginas? Hello. <laughs> you 
you know you want me. <laughs> anyway, I don't know why he's talking at me. That shouldn't light a cup properly. I think I might have done that wrong. Don't like it. It's shit. I'd rather just cut a banana. It looks pretty and it looks pretty cool. So I'm going to give it a one. I didn't like it. You just got more shit to clean, haven't you? Knife's easy, isn't it? Just cut your banana, wipe it on jam bottoms, back in jaw, jobs are good, in. Anyway. Oh, garlic. Next item. Quicker to use knife, definitely Leslie Williams. Oh my god, only just come on to your live fuming Ellie. What have I missed? Oh god, you missed these. I'm not even gonna tell you what they are. You're gonna have to watch it on replay. <laughs> Smells good. <laughs> Are you scared? You should be. Anyway, now, so about a million people tagged me in this motherfucker. Cracking an egg. I hate cracking eggs and I cook a lot of poached eggs, especially when I'm dieting. I can eat poached eggs. I can eat them until they come out of my arsehole, which I like. I love a good poached eggs. The bread, I'm not allowed. Can only have that occasionally, so it is very upsetting having a poached egg on its own. But occasionally I let myself have a bit of home meal toast. But yeah, I'm always cracking eggs and I'm always fucking up. I pop the egg, the white goes out, the yolk goes out. But this, apparently, cracks an egg in one simple motion. It's called Rompe. <laughs> Rompe, puppy. Rompe in my catalogue, in my dictionary. It's not know what to do with eggs. Rompy Pompey is Rompy Pompey. But this is Rompy Hoover's. It must be like, I don't know, French or summer, Spanish. Rompy? Is that Italian? Effortless, effortlessly. So you've got simply and effortlessly. They both bullshit you. They all lie. So this is effortlessly crack eggs with one simple motion. Separate the egg whites. Oh my God, you've got two jobs for one in this motherfucker. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I really appreciate the thousand viewers and I appreciate you staying as well. That means a lot to me. I hope you're enjoying the live video. And I get scared. I've got to come up with these random weird shit every Sunday and think, shit, I've got to be like amusing or oh, everyone's going to fuck off and leave me. What can I review? I know. I'll review some meat claws. Where does it come from? Right, open. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's a picture. I thought it were like poo stains in my thing. Anyway, we've got instructions, guys. It's promising. Oh, do I have to put stuff together? I'm not a DIY. Oh, my God. What the fuck? Mm. So, yeah, you've got this. <laughs> See this contraption that looks like something that you'd have at a smear clinic? Um, yeah, it looks like a speculum. But anyway, you've got to crack the egg with this. Don't understand it. Let's read instructions. Stage one, diagram one. Oh, your egg goes across like that. That goes down. That's how you do it. And squeeze and it cracks your egg in one simple motion. I'm excited. Diagram two, squeeze. Align the notches and insert your egg separator. Right, so the first one, we're just going to crack an egg. We're not even going to think about separating the fucker till we've tried actually cracking one. So I've got my bowl. I'm going to do it like this. You can see. Ah, amazing. Like, everything I do. I had to walk to cope and get all this random shit earlier. All the food. And carry it back because Conrad won't give me a lift. Where's my eggs? Oh, yeah. I think you and Conrad should eat a clove of garlic. Well, that could be another one, Ian. Could be. Yet again, Facebook fecking ass no notification sorry jane if you all click my nose now and you can choose to be notified you can choose to see first um there will be something you can click on the video to do that can you do el rado i will come back with el rado soon i haven't done him for a while right oh my god my egg is in <laughs> shit <laughs> shall i no we're not that stupid are we we don't need to crack eggs on ourselves to get attention. Like 15 million people on Facebook right now. If I get a thousand comments, I'm going to crack an egg on me head. If I get a thousand comments, I'm going to crack an egg on me husband, me wife, me daughter. So I did one and I put, if I get 500 comments, I'll never crack an egg. And I got 500 comments. Anyway, so I always have to be a bit different. Right, not insulting you if you've done that trick, by the way. You know, to get out on social media. But I'm sick of seeing it now. So we can stop it. Right, <laughs> let's crack the egg. I'm going to squish it now. 
Should we do a countdown? Five, four, excited. Three, she found it tingling. Two, one. actually fucking worked oh one piece of shell one little piece but that is not bad that is not bad going right now we're gonna try separate one. Oh my god this is life this is life and, and then you just go like that to get the shell out you've got to get one i got this online i will pop up a link in the above post afterwards so far it's a five let's try the separator so you put this little thing in the gadget somewhere oh shit it's still dripping look on my slipper where'd you put it you put this gadget oh god i can't do stuff oh yeah that way around ellie and then your gadget goes up there no put it in sorry it's technical guys you know what i'm like when it's technical I'm not good at technology this isn't technology, Ellie. It's a chuffing egg separator. It's got no technology. How's it go on then? <laughs> so I've got a little uh, thing in my groove there and then a thing there. But it's not working. Hang on. Oh, don't lose your points now. You got a five out of five and you're fucking up. You're going to break. Do you know what it is? It's got a little groove, but it's not, it's not grooved out enough. Come on, come on, come on, come to me. God, I sound like I'm having sex. Oh, come on, come on, nearly there. Uh, 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 uh. No, it's not gonna do it. <laughs> How will it do it? Or maybe you just, it's fucking annoying me now. <laughs> yeah, so kitchen items. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Yeah, it should go in there. Come on. Oh! I did it. You had to really have your Weetabix for that one, but we've done it. So now, I don't know whether the yolk or the white is supposed to go through there. Let's get another bowl and look at this situation. Got lots of bowls like Pyrex balls because you can do out with them they can go in the oven in like a million degrees and they don't break in incredible invention love a Pyrex dish <laughs> anyway get your neck away right so we're going to separate it this time so what does it show on picture the yolk should go nicely in these this is great for kids because kids like yolkies don't they I used to get my mum to make me yolkies all the time but she used to have to fanny about now she can get one of these are we ready? Oh, five, four, three, two, one. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. oh we've done it. Look at that. You get your yolk. My yolk is literally sat in there. Look at it. I'm not yolking. So it's, it's all there. The white is in the bottom. That is incre That is a brilliant invention. Let's just give the round of applause for the Rompe Hove. Why couldn't it have a better name? What? How's anyone ever going to fucking remember Rompe Hove? Will you fuck off? No one knows how to sort this Argos watch out that I got China like at Christmas and it's still beeping, trapped in my bread bin and it keeps us up at night and it's on all my live videos and it's on all my songs. When I'm doing Schmuel, it beeps. It fucking, it's got like a million settings. It's a Loris. If anyone wants it, they can fucking have it. It's doing the editing. Go back to bread bin. I can still hear it in bread bin. Does anyone else have one of them in their house? This alarm it just goes off. Right. So this was from Amazon. I will get you the link and I'll pop it above. It's a five out of five from me. Perfectly cracks eggs every time. I am upset that it's called Rompe Hoovers because I think it just should be called Egg Cracker or something like, like that. Like, no one's going to remember that. What a stupid name for your invention. Unless rompe hove or hovo means crack eggs in another language. But then why it's rest in English makes no sense. But yeah, that's what the box looks like. Get yourself on Amazon. I think it were about nine quid. 
um, for that little fucker, and it's amazing. Honestly, I love it. Five out of five. Yes, bitches. Right. I think we've only got one item left now to review. It's a very, very sad, sad affair. But this is quite a good item. So this was from Dunelm as well. And this was supposed to be £18 and it is £14.40. And I've always wanted to try one of these because I'm intrigued at how it works because it doesn't look like a chop, a fucking sausage. Never mind an onion or a potato because it looks like it's plastic. So it don't look sharp. But we're going to test it and it's by Oxo soft work and it is a vegetable and fruit chopper so apparently you chuck it in you slam it down chopped into cubes if this works i'll show my bare ass in boots right let's open it get in you did the banana one wrong did i well, we'll try the banana one again before i go because i'm not going to score it bad if i've done it wrong you can tell me in a minute how to do it how exciting was that kirsty i know Tell me right. The name means new break. Well, it is a new um, break for me. I'll be using that hooker every day for my eggs. Never going to miss crack an egg again. Hi, Maureen Pierce. Hi, Beverly Lee. Hi, Samantha Cox. Do the banana one again. You only use one at a time. Oh, is one smaller than the other? Ah, uh, no, it ain't. What do you mean? You put it on and then what then? Press it with your hand. How do you use one at a time? You tell me. Keep the comments coming with the banana thing. Everyone is always a fucking expert on my videos. Honestly, I could be showing you how to be a chocolate fire guard and they'd be an, ex they'd be an expert. I could be showing you how to paint you all tart and, and there'll be a chuffing tart and paint expert on here. No, I appreciate it. I want it because I really need to use this product properly because if I've done it wrong, I haven't given it justice. And I like that it's called a kitchen thingy. So we will try it again. Right, well, let's try the chopper first. I'm excited about this. It looks, it was supposed to be £18. £14.40. Honestly, I spent 70 quid in Dunnell Milnes, right? And look, half of it were this. What am I doing? Who am I doing it for? Oh, oh yeah, it has got a blade. It's very sharp. I just put my finger on it. <laughs> oh my god, this is really exciting and dangerous. <laughs> ma, 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 ma. Don't know why I, ch I chose the Coronation Street tune, but do you like good music? <laughs> why am I laughing with a vegetable chopper? Fuck knows. Right, so it does onions. Does it do full onions? Oh my God, yes, it does. So we literally chop, chop. I really don't want to chop my fucking cucumber. I like it too much. <laughs> it's my new friend. We're going to go upstairs later. Me and Mr. Cumber. No, we're not. We're not. That's why we're going to chop it and show you that. I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to stoop to that level. Right, where's my chopping board? Where's my knife? Move the eggs. Oh, I've got no space. I've got garlic, eggs, everything. Cucumbers. <laughs> <laughs> right, I've got an onion somewhere around here. Got an onion. Right, so I can chop the top and the bottom of the onion off really quickly. Do I have to? It doesn't say peel it. Cut food below before placing in the chopper. Well, surely I've got to peel the fucker. We can't put it in with skin on. I don't want to be eating skin. But it doesn't show to peel it, which is strange to use. Open chopper and place food on cutting area. Cut side down. Close lid. Place hands on thing. Point and push. Point and push. Oh, my God. Quickly and firmly. The, oh, this is hard for me. Point, push, quickly and firmly. Point and push. Point and push. Oh, my God. I'm scared. I'm just going to skin it because it's not going to... Ah, what's it going to do? Right. Onion is going in. In it goes. And then I'm going to have to put it down to point and push, okay? Let's put it down here again. You might want to remove comments if you want to get a proper demonstration of the point and push movement. What am I pointing at? That way? I'm just going to push it. Five, four, three, two, one. That was so... Sorry, sorry. 
I want to put Leon's penis in it. The one that sent me the dick pic. <laughs> Never send another willy. Never send another willy. <laughs> Pardon the pun. Shit, my life. But why is it so... Oh, no. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Didn't know it came out at the bottom. <laughs> oh, yeah. Didn't know that bit. But why, why, why does it do that? Oh, bollocks. It's all over my floor now. But why is it chopped like that and it's not in cubes? That's long. I mean, I can still use that. I can still fry that shit. Well, not now. It's dropped it all over the floor. I need a sweeping brush. <sighs> Yeah. The only thing I'm going to think of with this though is now you've got onion juts all over it. Do you have to wash it between each section? Because if you're going to chop an onion and then you're going to chop an apple or some fruit. Oh, fucking hell. Quality pun, yeah. Stay up, you bastard. Look, it just wants to eat whatever goes inside. Let's put um, an apple in, see what happens. It says chop the top, chop the bottom. Put it in. But I don't understand why it came out not cubed. It's got cubes, so why didn't it? I mean, am I doing something wrong here? It's not cubed, it's long. It shows me on the box. It all comes out finely chopped. Do I have to shake it? I mean, it's still chopped. What do I do here? Oh, I need a fucking bowl. <laughs> and then, livehdtvsemua.com. What are you advertising, Cristiano Gonzalez? Cristiano Gonzalez, Gonzalez off love, because I don't know what you're on about. We Google TVs, right? This is what you get. I mean, that does work for me because I like to eat my apple. I didn't really want apple cubes, did I? Oh, it is like a cube shape, look. It's just long. It tastes like onion. Onion apple. Right, finale. Goodbye, my lover. Goodbye, my friend. You've been good to me. This relationship's about to end. Why am I singing to a cucumber? Yeah. Right. <laughs> Come on, bad boy. Let's get you in here. I like this though. It's very, very, um, very sturdy and strong. I'm going to need to be for this cucumber. In it goes. I'm getting good at this. Points. Push. Don't fuck with me. I'll get your penis and I'll put it in here. And maybe that didn't work because it was too big for the machine. That was not good for the effect. Start again. Don't fuck with me or I will put your penis in here. This is what will be left of it. Send me a dick pic. Send me a dick pic. And this is what will be left of it. Incredible. Cube. Now I've got onion apple cucumber. But that will make a lovely fine salad, will that? I'm really excited about all this stuff that I've got. For like seven quid at Dunnell. I'm really happy that I've spent all this money. Right, before I go, because I got in trouble, I did the banana thing wrong. So has anyone got any advice on how I actually chop this motherfucker? Because I've got two things that go together like this. Not quite like that, Ellie. God, I'm so thick. Goes together. How do I chop it? Come on. Let me know. Because uh, this needs to be done. 
in need of one in my life. Actually, th yes, this is awesome. I will give it a five out of five. It's going to be a nightmare to wash, but I'll stick it in dishwasher like I do everything else. I even put my griddle pan in dishwasher. I even put my um, trays out of the oven in dishwasher. I put my trays in on one wash. <laughs> no else in. I'm so lazy. Replying to Natalie, she'd have to not swear for a start. She can't. What's Natalie saying? I need to go on, on what? I can not swear. I can because I don't always swear, like in my business groups, like obviously I'm a network marketer and when I'm training my team, I don't I don't really swear. I swear sometimes, <laughs> but I don't swear in every sentence like I do on here. This is the real reviewer. This is my alter ego. She swears, she's a twat. I'm like nicer, like I'm, I'm calmer than real reviewer. Right, banana time. I think I've got two bananas left. Five out of five from me, by the way, just before we put this away. It is called the... Um, Oh, first of all, we have to see if it chopped potato for chips. Oh, yeah. We have to see if we can do chips. Because everybody wants to do chips, don't they? For this, we need a potato. I thought I'd have a potato especially. Look. So we've just got to quickly peel it. Quickly peel this turkey now. Connor's going to love getting home and he's going to have chicken sarnies. It's going to come out length of whatever you put in. Onions have layers. That's correct. I'm a bit thick, Sophie. So I didn't realise. But now I realise it's still all right. It's good. It's a five out of five if it cuts this potato. Right, let's see. Just get all that cucumber out. That cucumber, bless it. It died a death. Right. Potato is going on. I'm going to smash it and we're going to see if we get chips. In fact, we want it long ways for chips, don't we? Oh, it fell over. You fell over. It fell over again. So we can't have it long ways. We've got to have it like that. Well, that's not going to make very good chips, is it? No, it's not going to. Right, do it that way. Cuts it, though. Cuts everything. Look at that. Little chips. But you can have little chips, can't you? <laughs> little chips. But they're cute, man. Uh, does anyone like raw potato? Some people eat raw potato. Who are these people? Where where were they born? Like what 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 rules did they have in their house? If you like raw potato, pop a heart below. If you like raw potato, and if you really don't like raw potato, pop I don't know a sick emoji. I think it's disgusting. Never knew you was live. Well, I did warn everyone. I said this morning. I said yesterday. Told everybody yesterday I'm going live at 8 o'clock. Told everybody this morning I'm going live at 8 o'clock on my video. And I told everybody just before the live a few hours ago that I was going live at 8 o'clock. Can't do no more than that. Michelle doesn't like potato raw. Who like? Oh my God. Lisa likes raw potato. Lisa Menard. What is wrong with you? Oh my God. Jen Chapman does. Fuck my life, it's awful. It makes me feel physically sick. But last night, I've got this great thing. I found something that Comrade hates. We went out for a meal and I got beef and I got horseradish dressing with it. I love a bit of horseradish, but I have tiny bits. And I said, just try it if you've never tried it. Well, they were nearly sick. All the way through his meal, he couldn't think no else but horseradish. So next time we do a challenge, if he's got a blindfold on, fucking tablespoon of horseradish. I can't wait. He will, he will literally gip in for about an hour. He couldn't get it out of his head. You should be on QVC. No, no. I couldn't be serious. I'd tell everyone it were a bag of shite and not to buy it. Can someone actually tell me how to do this banana then? Because I've got to go now. <laughs> raw mushrooms is all right, Amanda, but raw potato is vile. Everyone's been sick. Use the two cutters together on one banana. All right. But why? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You said you get thinner fuckers. Oh, I get it. Thanks, guys. I need another plate. You want all the plates here? Oh, let me get another banana. Don't leave me now, bitches. You're leaving me, and I'm doing the banana right. Horseradish smoothie. Oh, no, yeah. That'd be a good one. Right, banana on the plate. Oh, I can't do it on plate because plate's curved. I'm going to have to do it on unit, guys, and I'll show you what happens. Right, you ready? Oh, that happened. I don't like this contraption. What is life? 
do you, I don't know. You're all having a go at me saying I'm doing it wrong, but this is what, this is what I'm getting. Let me just tap it. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's coming, coming, oh, coming up, coming up, coming up. It's there. You've got to stab your nails through it, which again, I could chop a banana quicker than that. Didn't like it. That banana lost its head. You only use one of them. Serious? But why? If you use one, it's right big. Flip it and push it down the other way. It's not both, it's just one. But why would you get two then that clip together? That doesn't make no sense. Top of green peas. Put banana on top of green peas and then put yellow on top. Fuck my life, I'm just going to get my last banana. <laughs> Bananas are pretty soft. Maybe I should have got some new ones. Maybe these are like 10 month old. Love raw potato. Katrina, my mama always said it would give me worms. Oh, Katrina, I'm going to be sick, love. Don't eat raw potato. Put the green part on the surface. Place the banana and use the yellow one on top. Well, didn't I do that the first time? I did that the first time. Fuck my life. Right, it's on the green. I'm going to put the yellow on the top. It's hard to line it up like. No. I haven't lined it up right, so it hasn't worked. Because you've got to get it lined up, that's stupid. Oh, fuck's sake. Don't like this. I don't like it. It's annoying me. You can't line it up. Oh, yeah, do it like that. Right, I think it does work. Maybe if your bananas are a little bit harder. But I don't like it. I'd prefer just to go <laughs> with my chef knife. Be straight done. And I don't have to poke my finger through it to get my banana out. It is still a one for me. I'm not interested. Don't like it. It feels awful slimy. It does look a bit gory as well. Where are you going to put that in your kitchen? Like, I've got to think of another thing for that. I don't like it. Take it, it's not five out of nine, it's one out of five just because it, it's called a kitchen thingy and I thought that would cute. Handy kitchen thingy. But it's not very handy, is it? It didn't fucking chop my banana. I used three bananas. And that's what I did the first time. And I've tried all your ways now. So please stop telling me I'm doing it wrong because I'm sorry. But if you have to be a banana chopping fucking expert to use this motherfucker, then you don't want one anyway, do you? Like, because... I'm a normal average woman and I'd look at this and it's got no instructions and I'd go, right, I put my banana in there and I go like that and that's what I did first time. That didn't work. So, all right, so I'll put it together and chop it on the side. That didn't work. I don't want to just use one because I don't want big pieces of banana. Right, I'm going now, guys. Love you lots. It's been an absolute pleasure. Oh, let me just read some comments before I go. Helen McIntosh, silent viewer. Love your vibes. Hair's on point. Thank you, Helen. Philippa, Michelle Younger, you haven't used just one. No, because what's the point in that? I don't understand. Why do you, why would you use one when you get two? Why would they, why wouldn't they just sell it as one? They're the same size then. So why wouldn't you they just sell one banana thingy, kitchen thingy? Why have you got two if you only use one? That makes no sense. Why do I want to do that? Why didn't you just sell me one? Push some frigging instructions to prove my point. Oh yeah, there is instructions. You put it on the green one. Oh, set of two. <laughs> Ran out of bananas now, guys. But anyway, I still don't like it. But set of two nesting banana slices. Ideal for preparing desserts. Step one, you get two centimetres thick. Step two... You get one centimetre thick. Ah, but step two, you use them both together, which I tried and it didn't work. And step one, you just use one on its own. But I didn't want to do it because I didn't want thick fuck of bananas. I could just cut them in five little chops. It'd be much easier and it saves less washing up. It's still a one. It's still shit. Don't like it. Hi, Danielle Barton. Thank you. What are you What are you like, hon? Well, I'm all right, me. Because I'm just a normal human. We're on back. Stupid thing. 
Lovely to see you. It seems like an age since seeing your bloody Facebook. Sorry, Lisa Leonard, I'm live every Sunday at 8 o'clock, but last night I had date night, so I might be moving it to every Monday at 8 o'clock. So it'll be either be Sunday or Monday, you'll catch me every week. So tune in next week, it'll be Sunday or Monday. I'll let you know beforehand on my wall. Ellie Norcliffe, follow me on Ellie Norcliffe if you aren't already, because that's where I tell you where I'm when I'm going live. Right, love you lots, love you long time. Spread your legs, bitches. Keep sharing, keep getting me out there, keep liking, keep loving, press follow, and I will see you soon. Bye.